Well, fine art's been studied here for over 120 years. It's quite a unique course. Some places like painting or sculpture or conceptual installation stuff. Our course at DMU has all of those and more. And I think that is down to the broad range of staff that work here. They're all practicing artists. We've got great setups as well. In Leicester, particularly, we've got uh, a gallery, the Two Queens, which is a fantastic contemporary gallery, set up by ex-DMU fine art graduates. And they're feeding back, giving our students the opportunity to go uh, and work in the gallery, curating shows. There's also a second year exhibition that's run by our local LCB, where the second years curate work themselves that goes on outside. It's all student-led initiatives. I think the facilities are great. The studios are open till late at night, the weekends. They have great access to the workshops. The workshops are second to none in the country. One of the great things about being on the course at DMU are the trips. I must have taken 400 fine art students over the last five years to New York, uh, Cyprus. We were involved in an exhibition of work that the students made within that week. Quite often the students are using the things that they're discovering on the, these trips bring them back to the degree show. You know, every year I'm amazed by what the students go on to do when they graduate. Many of them go on to be art therapists, restorers, curators, illustrators. We have a, a really good program of visiting artists that come to talk to the students. Artists like David Trigley and John Stesica. And also, afterwards, they'll give the students tutorials. They really enjoy that and they're getting really good advice about how to move their work forward. Come to an open day, you'll see for yourselves, you get a chance to talk to the staff and to students to see how they're getting on.